and uh, t pin down Kage and maybe get some kind of cheese kills on Camilo. Also, also maybe to stay close together to each other so that they can uh, try to help if the other is in danger right away. Unfortunately, that's like a little SD for Chris Fish there. Didn't exactly see, but it looked like he just air dodged. Yeah, I think so. Great shine spike. So blue team's just controlling space right now. Uh, wow. You no, know, Kage swinging and like he's just he's just cleaning up the hits. Yeah. Like he sees he sees them flying around. And he just jumps up with a massive hitbox. And Chris good. getting these tippers. Oh no! But he backed off and didn't help Tina. Kage with that down tilt to save. Yeah, that was perfect. If if uh, Hello didn't grab Kage there, he would have been able to jump up for like a forward air or something. So that was perfect. Yep. Oh, okay. Tipper's Kage with the Ooh. spike. Damn, Krim going in, though. Krim Foyce. Yeah, Krim Foyce is rocking both blue team members right now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. Oh, and Rano comes to his aid. <laughs> Cena, Cena supporting. Getting good hits. All right, Krim. Krim help. He's trying to. Oh, he saved. He helped. He distracted uh, Camilo enough that... uh. He's able to get on. Oh, he gets a shine against the wall, but... Yeah, I, I noticed uh, Krim Foyce kind of has a little bit of trouble like finding you know, the best way to recover, the smartest way to recover. Yeah, he had so. bad DI when he got hit against the wall. He could have made it onto the stage if he survived the DI done the shine. Mm. And even the previous stock, like he jumped away from the ledge when his double jump could have just grabbed it by itself. Ooh. And then he got shine spikes. That's true, that's true. Yeah, and that, that made him get killed early too. Yeah. Oh, I think Kage with a bit of friendly fire. Killed his teammate. Still a pretty solid lead for Blue. Yeah, Green Team brought it back a little bit, but uh, Krim Foish had a really high percent now. Yep. Yeah, is that kill percent? Anything that hits, and Cena might just die. Uh, right yeah. Now. Or hello, I should say. Oh my goodness. Okay. Three sucks. Pretty, pretty concrete win. Pretty yeah. solid. Solid win. Uh, splitting four kills, four kills a piece. Good stuff. No SDs then. It looked like Krim Foyce SD'd at the beginning, but I guess not. Well, you had to got hit before he killed himself. You're right. You're right. Possibly. Oh, oh my God. Kage with the double stomp there. No. I, Isaiah dropped double stomp. Too. Yeah. It's so brutal how Ganon can stomp you like through the platform. I know. It's insane. Kage going in for these Yeah. Combos. He was trying to get the bounce off the down air into an up air. That would have been so dirty. Yep. Dealing massive damage. It's hit like four moves, maybe. Ooh. If Krim just like whipped out a back air there, that would have been perfect. Could have started an edge guard. Alright, Cena killing Kage. Krim is in a dangerous spot here. He needs to figure oh, something friendly out. Friendly fire. Alright, Kage, good distraction, and he kept pressure on both players. So they weren't able to edge guard uh, on it. Krimfoy's finally getting in there with a the neutral air, but he's not hes not seeming to do so much uh, help when when Hello is on the edge needing to recover. Seems to be kind of afraid to go in. Yeah, it seems like that as well. Alright. Wow! <laughs> back to back. We take those, I guess. Throwing the sword smashes. Everybody's laughing, having a good time. Okay, Krimfoy's jumping around, rolls into a grab. Oh, this is such a strange scramble. Like, yeah. they weren't getting hit that much, even though they were both so close together on the left side of the stage. And in those situations, it seems like Kage, like, he doesn't know really what to do because Ganon's so big and so slow. He's such a huge target. He just seems to, like, whip out jabs and forward tilts a lot. Yeah. Which I think it's pretty good. The big, the moves with big wind up, they'll get intercepted a lot. Yeah. If he's sandwiched in between everybody. Alright. Good, good kill by Chris again. Oh. Uh, he got scared. Kage just needs to get a back air on Krim Foyce here, or a down air. There we go. Good platform push by Camilo there. That shine's not going to be enough to kill Hello. Oh, yeah, he's back in Shino stalling. Shino stalls are so strong in doubles. Kage's got that though. A lot of times, your teammate want, uh, your opponents want to like finish the stock and just keep pressure on you, but then Shino stalling just like. Keeps them away, and if they don't respect your space to get hit, yeah, it does a decent amount of damage too. With the knockdown, with some players, like if you Shino stall against them, it can kind of put them on tilt too. Like they get annoyed. 
Exactly. They just want to go in and then they end up getting hit by the explosion. Exactly. That's gonna be it. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that hitbox though. <laughs> All the down smash cut through Fox's forward tilt. <laughs> Holy crap. Yeah, very unpopular opinion about Sheik and the strength of Rasino stalling in doubles. I think Fox is not that good versus Sheik in teams because a lot of his moves like push her to the edge and then just grab the ledge and just like stall and wait. Yeah. Wait for your teammate to come help or 